Hey everyone, welcome back to Crown Geek. In this video, I will be explaining that how to fix no Wi-Fi network found but Wi-Fi is turned on. This problem mostly occur on Windows 10 but it can be also on Windows 11. I will be sharing few effective solution that will be applicable for both the operating system and I'm pretty sure that you will be getting the solution after watching this video. So what happened when you click on your Wi-Fi so it shows that it has been turned on but when you look over the network it doesn't show any so what you need to do on your windows 10 or 11 click on the search box and here you have to type cmd you will be getting command prompt you need to make a right click on it and choose run as administrator then click on yes the black window will be coming up here you have to type sfc space forward slash scan now hit enter now this will be scanning all the system file for any kind of infection and integrity violation so you just need to wait so this will be taking some time so we can just minimize it now again make a right click on your windows icon and from the suggestion choose device manager now here in the device manager you have to look for network adapters double click on it and it will display you your wi-fi network adapter it can be intel it can be any other so look for the one and on my end you can see it's intel wi-fi so i will look for this and i will make a right click on it and choose update driver then i need to click on browse my computer for drivers then click let me pick from a list and here try to select any other wi-fi adapter then click on next and now this will be installing the driver then click on close and now it also might ask you to restart the computer so if it give you the prompt to restart then restart the computer and check back that if the problem has been fixed if not then again make a right click on it and then click on uninstall device and if you get this box delete the driver software so you do not need to check this box keep this unchecked and then click on uninstall after doing this from the top menu option you have to click on action then click on scan for hardware changes and your wi-fi adapter will be back after doing this check back if the problem has been fixed and if not then make a restart and check back again still if you have the issues do not need to worry i have few more solution again make a right click on it and choose properties here click on the advanced tab and look for channel weight for 2.4 gigahertz make sure the right side value section has been to set to auto the same you have to do for channel width for 5 gigahertz set it to auto and then from the top menu option only click on power management and uncheck this option that says allow the computer to turn off this device to save power then click on ok and now you can close it again check back if the problem has been fixed in case still if you have the issues then on your search box type reset and from the suggestion you have to look for network reset click on it another page will be coming up here you have to click on reset now so make sure that you remember the password for your wi-fi so that the next time when you will try to connect it will ask you for the password so that's all guys for today if you get the solution make sure that you hit the like subscribe and if you still have the issues, any problem, any question, let me know in the comment section. And I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.